Good morning guys, how are you doing? So today is Sunday. It's not the nicest weather, it's been raining all morning. Um, but I've just been out for a walk because I need to stretch my legs a bit. And um, before I start today's vlog, I did actually record a few clips yesterday, but it kind of started a bit sporadically. So it was kind of all over the place where I just decided to film a few clips of us going shopping. And then it ended quite abruptly because I went to a wine, no, sorry, it wasn't wine, cheese and side party, and it was an all day event. So we all arrived about four o'clock and then it went on till about 11 o'clock. But there are some clips on here that I really do like from shopping in the morning. And then I also recorded some things on Instagram stories. And before I left, I was trying to get rid of the bags underneath my eyes. I have like a coffee on my fingers right now. I hope that is coffee. <laughs> so I'm gonna insert those clips that I did manage to record yesterday by here and then there is an Amazon package that we need to open that I picked up yesterday from the Amazon locker. This is the camera that I was just recording on and minus the packaging it goes like that. But obviously take away the packaging and it goes on top of this camera, specifically these little holes by here. Let's have a look in, James. I do really like the thing. But that one's got poppers. <laughs> I like poppers. Yeah, I do like this one as well. But this is too satisfying not to go with it. Like when I take this off then later on in the day, it's just like... We went with the blue one in the end because the pink one had a bit of a pen mark on it. And there was no other small. So as you may or may not know, and these bags underneath my eyes really do um, bother me and I would like to reduce the effects as I'm going out soon and I don't usually use makeup. I say that, I don't think I've ever worn makeup before so I'm using the, as you know, um, concealer. I'm, I'm using that thing Concealer. That, um, that makeup is used for. Am I doing alright so far? Yeah. <laughs> So what do I do now? You dab it on the area you want it covered, the dark areas. You need a mirror. I don't know what I'm doing. <laughs> How can you can't even see in there. You need a mirror to see what you're doing. Completely missed. Just got it. Oh. I've completely missed the bag on my eye. Put a bit by there and a bit. It needs to go. Don't touch. Don't touch your mirror. <laughs> <I don't. laughs> you're making a joke. <laughs> <laughs> I don't know why I reacted like that. <laughs> I look a bit less tired. Oh no! <laughs> Sorry for that um, for that information, but that spot has started bleeding. Cut, cut the clip. I think that's gonna have to do for the bags underneath my eyes. Um, I've actually been getting ready to go out to a cider and cheese party over Alids because it's a really nice day today so I'm just a bit concerned a minute as like a big group of people sat there and then the spot starts bleeding without me knowing because I can't exactly just walk around with a mirror to keep an eye on it but I'm just about to leave now it's at four o'clock and if you look at the clock by here it's dead on four o'clock so I should probably leave right now I thought I had a camera then for some reason. <laughs> it's a micro wind jammer. So this goes on the top of your camera. As you might have seen in the past few weeks, some of the videos have been very windy and I've either had to put subtitles over them or just put music over it altogether. And I'm really not sure how these work. I've seen some people when they buy these, they kind of cut the top of it, but the muffler should stop the wind. On the instructions, it looks like this dude by here is only using one, one of these. I have three pads of this. So what's that? 
What's my mental maths? There's 10 on each strip. So I have 30 of these. I've just tried this out now. It goes on something like that. It's not on there a minute because I carried on talking for about a minute as normal. And then I decided to check the audio and it's completely muffled. You can't hear me at all. So I'm not quite sure a minute. And I do need to take this camera back to Curry's tomorrow because in some clips, not in all clips, and you might have actually seen this if you've seen more than one of these videos is that every <coughs> excuse me i have a really bad throat for some reason in some clips a little black dot appears in like the bottom like by here somewhere so i need to take it back to curry's to see why that's happening like i thought it was just a smudge on the screen but it can't be because it's only in some clips so i'm going to leave the muffler off for now i'm going to take the camera back get it sorted out and then try to figure out how this works exactly one hour from now my mum has been picked up to go to a concert with my sister. She's going to see Anastasia in Cardiff. She's upstairs getting ready. Although I've got a gift for her, which she might recognize. It's kind of like the second time I'm giving her this gift, but this time it's finished. So I'm just going to see. Mum? Yeah? You getting ready? Yeah. Okay, good. When are you leaving? Um, um, so why? Right, okay. It's half two now, mind. Yeah. Okay, cool. That's all. Right. Yeah, I, I, I think I've got to be there for three. Okay, cool. Is everything all right? Yes, you've got about half an hour. Yeah. Cool. I want this guy by here. But I really don't have long because as she comes down the stairs, she's going to notice that it's missing. Just saying hello. Hello. Hope you have a great night when you go out soon. I'll be in in a minute. I've got to come and do my in now. I've got a gift for you. A gift? Yeah. It wouldn't be my frame off the wall by you by any chance. Damn it! <sighs> <laughs> that was the worst timing. I literally just took it down. And I was like, if you come down the stairs, you're going to notice it straight away. But no, it's not the frame. No. No. It was a bit too obvious to notice, right? I'm not gonna put the pictures in now. I do have the pictures here. Um, I was about to say, before she come downstairs, that I'm either gonna just place them in and then give it as a present, or I'll show you the photos that we've got, that we've taken over the past year, and then we'll put them in together and decide how we want them to go. But it's all been ruined now. And I don't really know why I'm still whispering. Do you wanna go and put the photos in? This took me so long to get the photos that are the correct dimensions for this frame because Why have you been finding photos, honey? I found, well, I'm not going to show you the photos No, 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 no oh. I'm not going to show you the photos in a minute Let me prop you guys up somewhere Oh, I can't show you them Right So we're kind of just going to decide which order to put them in But the first one How do we need? One, two, three, four, five You've got oh, five yeah. there, have I you? I think I'm just going to put them on the screen as opposed to try showing them to the camera The first one is probably my favourite photo of us of all time. <laughs> it's the one that the uh, lovely old lady. Where was that taken? Simmons, no? Simmons Yat. Simmons Yat. Outside yeah. the church. Probably one of my favourite photos that we've ever had. Really? Um, the second one is our Mother's Day photo that we had <laughs> when we went to Ikea. That's right. It Again, was I remember when that photo was taken. I was like, I love that photo so much. <laughs> And it's actually got the photo frame in the background in the that background. we're never completing. Yeah, yeah. I'm going to look back and see when we actually, when we got this photo frame. Okay. It should say on a vlog of yours. Yeah, yeah. The next one, can you guess it? Just photos that I've loved in the past few months. This is when we both went to an event together. Oh, um, and we were both the masquerade. Wearing, yeah, we were both wearing black. Oh my god, that's lovely, isn't it? Huh? Right, this one I don't think you'd be able to guess. This is actually the first one. It's not a picture, it's a print screen from a video. But I tried to find something where we both were having a load of fun. Aye. And it's the... when we built the ginger bed house <laughs> during Vlogmas. <laughs> In my dressing! <laughs> <laughs> and that video starts with like, are you, are you going to wear that dressing gown for this video? <laughs> But I love that photo so Yeah, much. because I'm going to work. <laughs> <laughs> the gingerbread house. 
wasn't exactly fantastic. No. But it was... we've, we've actually kept that gingerbread house. Yeah. Because for next year now, we're going to redo this video and see if we can improve <laughs> on this creation. And then the last one has actually got an additional person in it as well. Additional? James! And it's a time when we were hysterically laughing. James! <laughs> It was from the Most Likely To Challenge, which I referenced incorrectly in last week's video. I thought this was from a different one. This is from the Most Likely To, not the Mum vs. Uncle. But it's the one where you just died of laughter oh, I don't right know. at the start. <laughs> so, we got five, and there's five to put in here. Where'd you get these from you sent off from? I got these from Snapfish. It's a oh. website that you can print photos. Right, right. And I'm really happy with the quality as well. It's like a matte, yeah, yeah, matte effect on them. Yeah. But I love those five photos. Would you want them then? I think because it's my favourite. I think that one should maybe go to the top. How do they go in from the top? Might be. I think we'd have to do it from the bottom actually. The back actually. Let's just see what it is. We'd have to do it from the back. There we go. <laughs> it's the James and Mum with uh, an additional feature of James. Is that how you want it? Yeah. There we go, we sorted the photo frame. Family is where life begins and love never ends. Our dreams are big and we never ever give up. Like branches we grow, yet our roots remain as one. That's fact, isn't it? Tell me if that's all right now. Turn it around somewhere. Yeah, perfect. <laughs> hey. Right. Tells a story. That was the idea, wasn't it? <laughs> yeah. That's <laughs> right. Here we go. Oh, wow. Look at that story there. <laughs> Don't it? Don't it tell a story? I'm still a bit gutted when he came down the stairs. You noticed it then straight away that it was Why missing, did you? I notice it. Yeah, um, I did say, I literally said just before it. I'm going to notice something's missing off my wall as If you come that. downstairs, you're going to notice that's gone. Yeah. And the moment I took it away, you spotted it. Oh. If, you, if you haven't seen the latest um, Mum vs Uncle video, which is kind of similar to this video by here, then it's up on my channel now, so go and check that out. <laughs> comes to something, I laugh at myself, isn't it? <laughs> and there we have it. That is this week's vlog. I really hope that you have enjoyed this video. One last thing before I go. You may know that last year I volunteered with the Prince's Trust. We worked on an enterprise program, which is to help young people aged 18 to 30 all across the UK. The charity is all about helping young people to build their confidence and learn the essential skills that they need to find work, whether that is to become their own boss or to find their dream job. And this charity has always been very, very close to my heart. My mum has always been a support worker since before I was born. And that is what these guys do. They support you on your journey to help you find work. So it's just a wonderful, wonderful charity to support. So this Monday on June 5th, which is tomorrow, it's called a Future Wales event. And I'm going down to speak on a panel about employability and adult stuff and being in your 20s. I believe there's quite a bit about digital media as well and how digital media influences employability. Um, I'm going to be vlogging the event as well as been on the panel and they've also asked me to do the event photography as well so it's going to be quite a busy day i'm really hoping to learn some new things but that will be a big part of next week's vlog i really hope you enjoyed this video i am going to relax for a bit now before i get an early night and yeah thank you very much again for watching and i'll see you again very very soon bye <laughs>